Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Walt Whitman from Brooklyn. And I'm going to read an excerpt from one of my favorite poems. It's Crossing Brooklyn Ferry. Flood tide below me, I watch you face to face. Clouds of the west, sun, there, half an hour high. I see you also face to face. Crowds of men and women attired in the usual colors. How furious you are. On the ferry boats, the hundreds and hundreds that cross returning home are more curious to me than you suppose. And you that shall cross from shore to shore years hence are more to me and more in my meditations than you might suppose. The impalpable sustenance of me from all things at all hours of the day, the simple, compact, well-joined scheme, myself disintegrated, everyone disintegrated, yet part of the scheme, the similitudes of the past and those of the future, the glories strung like beads on my smallest sights and hearing, on the walk in the street and the passage over the river, the current rushing so swiftly and swimming with me far away. The others that are to follow me, the ties between me and them, the certainty of others, the life, love, sight, hearing of others. Others will enter the gates of the ferry and cross from shore to shore. Others will watch the run of the flood tide. Others will see the shipping of Manhattan north and west and the heights of Brooklyn to the south and east. Others will see the islands large and small. Fifty years hence, others will see them as they cross. The sun, half an hour high, a hundred years hence, or ever so many hundred years hence, others will see them will enjoy the sunset, the pouring in of the flood tide, the falling back to the sea of the ebb tide. It avails not, neither time nor place, distance avails not. I am with you, you men and women of a generation, or ever so many generations hence. I project myself. Also, I return. I am with you and know how it is. Bravo! Thank you, ladies. Mr. Walworth from Brooklyn.